to another vlog for today we'll be going to Nusa and we are at a stop um, we actually got some coffee here from Macas so I've got a mocha and a latte and they have the Monopoly game back on and while we're having our coffee before we head to our final stop for today we'll be checking out an area right here so let's go Okay, so we got out of the car. Sorry for my load because I didn't even put makeup on for this morning because we are heading to the beach anyway. So we are in the middle of a forest. There you go, look at that. The sunrise is actually right over there. But we found this sweet spot. There's a lot of pine trees. There you go. It is quite chilly in this place and it's very serene, very quiet. You could hear the birds chirping and it's echoing of everywhere. I just heard a... Yeah, if you would just listen to it, right? The water is very clear. This is called the boiling point. Okay, so we are walking towards the fairy pools. If we can still see them, it's off the beaten track. Hell's Gate is 1.5 kilometers away, but we're going to go there, no babe? Is that one? I don't know. Yeah, we're going to be going there. We're almost there. We're looking for the fairy poles. Yeah. On the edge. Is it that one? Yeah. Ooh. Scary. Whoa. I'm clumsy. I'm a little bit of Okay. So rocky. Alright, so we are 
are here at the fairy pool and I'm sitting at the edge of the rock. I thought I wouldn't be able to make it considering the anxiety and everything walking to the park and everything. But we did make it. now we are heading back over where we came from which is like really far like then a panahon jump in and take a dip right now and we are going to be exploring the sand a little bit more gonna wade in a little bit Australia is more firm it's fine but it has a cornstarch feel to it so when it dries over when wet it is kind of like this texture it's very solid and firm you don't even see my footprints so let's come closer to the water see how temperature goes Woo! see I'm at the edge but I don't really see much footprints <gasps> Ooh, it is freezing. It's super cold. It's still super cold to go for a, for a dip. Super cold. See? Can I go back up? It's warm again. That's pretty nice. So you can walk and drive. That's why a lot of beaches here in Australia, you can drive up the wide beaches if you have a four-wheel drive um, car or truck, whatever you have, we wish to have one so we can drive up in surfaces like this. But this one is not drivable yet because it's pretty thin. <laughs> Oh, 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 
clear. So I still have some of the ice cooler left. We're heading back to the main beach just to sit. It's been the last long today. Let's have a sit somewhere, babe. May nika kite flying na doon. Here. Laguna Lookout. It's a two to three minutes drive up from Hastings Street. Well, I'd say maximum of five if it if you're driving really slow, but it is. Mm -hmm. And so, right on the sides, you can see markers that say Lake Weba, Mount Irwa, Mount Kuroi. And that's because what corresponds to them are actual mountains. If you see the peak, there it is. Mas wider na beach to. Look at him go! Yeah, he 
got it! Good job! Uh, <laughs> I got furry hands. Uh, it wants to play with you. He still doesn't want to go home. So, we found a helicopter. Not we found, we, we spotted it. Um, it's carrying something. Is it a tree? Maybe it looks like a tree. Helicopter. Wait, it's a tree! It's carrying a massive tree! <laughs> yeah, this tree is expensive! Heli lift. And there's another helicopter at the distance. It's waiting for it. It's kind of guiding it. I think some rich person bought it. A massive tree. Well, we've landed. <laughs> we've driven ourselves to a lookout where we don't know where it is. So let's go. Let me remove my phone charger. What's in here? Ooh, this is a nice view.